Hello everyone and welcome to my video. So today on 24th of February 2021 Estonia celebrates its 103rd birthday. For that I will be playing Hearts of Iron 4 as Estonia on this special Estonian history or something like that mod. And it will be probably long video, really long video, because I have no plans of giving up. I will probably just like um, play as long as possible. Maybe cut it shorter a bit. Wait, what? Oh, yeah. Now I remember. It's because of uh, have. Two mods. Basically, one is changes to Estonia, and one is something related to Estonian history. I don't remember exactly. <sighs> this planes. I mean, I like this Estonian flag, don't I? What do the What do the tanks look like? Default smile. I hope it even works without crashing. What? There's definitely a problem with this political thing. Because... Oh, at least the border is still fine. Like... This is the real border. A normal Hoi 4, you would get that border. But no, that's a real border. Because... Um, between the between the independence war and occupation of Estonia in 1940, we used to have this county. There was a Petserima named county, and also in there, across this Narva River, we had three municipalities. Sadly, in this game with this mod, we still don't have it, but yeah, still much better than. And the base game. Let's be honest, let's buy from Germany. They're not democratic or anything. Soon we won't be as well. Because. Definite. Oh no. We have basically only guys from one mode, not from another. And therefore we do not have um, light on it was great here. Can we at least get Walka? Yes, we can get Walka. Um, yes. Now, so far, our poli our political thing may be a bit broken. Just a bit, you know. Um, yeah, that will be interesting. Once I get enough uh, political power to start going to fascist way, we'll see what will happen. Yeah, right now, only thing we could do is train, but let's be honest, we don't have guns for that. Yeah. Firstly, we need to reinforce our divisions. Wait, we actually have to carry anything? What? Like, we have no occupied land. Well, it's not too good of a plan. But my plan is... To so, so quickly as possible invade Latvia. Do I think it's a good idea? No. Do I still want to do it? Very much. So I'm I'm sorry, but that's just one thing that is needed to be done if I want to survive because there's no way that this small territory even has a chance against the Red Army. Like, well, yes, there is a chance if you like play better and this time it's only historic helps you. But other than that there's no chance. Like you have, or you have to be like really good player, at least. Mm 
Will this give anything? Wow, um... 100% in popularity. Wait, does this mean that we can already go for a referendum? We could. Damn. That was really quick change in politics. Wait, what? No, no, no. No, no, no. We are not... We are not pressing them down. Opsie is the way. So... Alright. And they have two divisions, right? At least we have the airplanes. Um... I mean, they got our commander. That's not good. But I, I think we need to be able to destroy them. Alright. Let's, let's rush start. Like, as you probably understand, the Civil War never happened. In Estonia. Uh, actually, closest thing to that is that in. Oh, they have two divisions. Rip me. Is that the beginning of the 30s? Basically, uh, there was this guy, Constantine Bet, with some other countrymen basically took over Estonia. Alright, I need to reach Tartu before they reach Tallinn. Otherwise it's otherwise it's Kege. Otherwise it's Chichi. Please. Go to Tartu. Go to Tartu. Oh, they are going for Narva. So we actually have a chance. Oh no. If they take Tallinn, then it's over. Oh no. Uh, they took Tallinn before they capitulated. Wait. Is it enough? It could be. I mean... <laughs> so they got Tylin and they gave up. That's just how we're unrealistic this mod is. No, I'm definitely regretting not having enough political power. By the time I uh, basically send you referendum, because that basically destroyed our army, all our military. We at least still have the factories, that's something. But we lost some of our manpower and we already didn't have too much manpower so it's horrible in that by that meaning um I definitely want like if not the whole Latvia then at least this Volka region like, I don't care about the rest, but this town Volka. Yeah, Volka. That's our, that's ours. In this game. In reality, it's not. And it's alright. Like, yeah, but in this game, it has to belong to Estonia. And of course, it would be nice if I, like, got other parts of Latvia as well. Wait, what's something we have that? Hmm, just six infantry. Wait, what? I like how we fought a war and we got 0 0.22 army XP from it. 
same time of train would be probably more efficient to okay, get the XP. But it seems like we actually have to train or exercise, like I said. Now, I need to change the conscription law as so soon as possible. Because let's be hon honest, we need more men to our military. Because there really is no other way to get what we want. Oh, uh, by the way, also. You probably un understood that the soundtrack is not a normal one. Basically, it's Estonian soundtrack. Oh, there are actually multiple radio stations? I mean, out of these, I don't know what they have. Hmm, alright. Let's put this one in. That's the best, in my opinion. Yeah, Estonian songs. I don't know like all of them, but most of them. Um, yeah, play. What? Where did the cool Nerf to Baike come from? Seems like there is some kind of a problem with this radio. I mean, these are great, but I need industry as well. So I don't even know what we should go right now. Oh, we finally got our second vision. What? All right, what a, quite a few more mixed three points. We need artillery. And we need some more men in divisions. That's a also third and then stop it for it. Stop with it for a moment. Oh, we need artillery. Do we even have artillery research? We have right. Hmm. That's not good for our productions. But that's just the thing we need. Out of the options, is there Sweden here? Yeah. Let's try it with Sweden. wrong with this I guess they just have that that one then actually let's retry uh, alright so just one of the some song respect well that's music This one basically talks about Estonian, or I think it was Narva battle that fought in Russia on the German side. And like nowadays in Western Europe and USA. If you think about it, maybe you think they fought for Germany. Technically that's true because they fought in this army. But the reason why they fought why they fought was not like what they they liked Hitler or fascism, no. Not even Germany. Most of them. It was basically I think against Red Terror. Because Soviet Union if they are not the first thing that have ever happened to us, Estonians and Estonians, that's definitely on the list.
and also like even worse reactions are when you hear that they fought in SS divisions. You may think that well these are just like 100% fascists. No. Basically just some units were made to SS just forcefully forcefully conscripted. Some of them were in SS like the division names and unit names were SS. They had nothing to do with the uh, death camps or anything. Concentration camps. These are great names, see. Also, yeah, I, I like this this swap seat thing. I'm thinking, did I already talk about it? Because we are we are another basically basically this in this game they are fascists because in Estonia yes there were. They were the closest ones to fascism, but I would not really call them fascists. Oh, um, I should have probably gone that one down to build these lines. Well, never mind. Already into it. I'm not ready for that conflict. But will I be in 70 days? I think so. If these divisions are ready, then 5000? This song is basically Forest Brothers. They were basically the men that hide themselves in forests to fight against communists. And during the Soviet era, era all of these songs were, of course, loud like our flag I have heard stories about people who just had them or even worse they used the same flag and like and for that they got five to ten years in prison today it sounds just like a crazy thing but that's sort of case, it was just reality. We now have enough of still need more money. We should get it fulfilled, yeah. It's May 13th, yes, we are getting it fulfilled. So it tends to probably uh, probably in media some of us well saber of still not in resolution. Just the name of it is Yeah, 
like this, there's still no flags here, it's just dope. I really like it. <laughs> Call it glass. Call it glass, basically. You have shoes up for me, I think? Let's see. Or the flashpoint of Volca. Volca. Volatians. The new government has decided to bring up the discussion of Volca Volca border and relations. The current government of Estonia has two choices. Will they press to play on Volca Volca and they made that yeah. I mean, we will take what's ours. We will take what's ours. And now, of course, we will ally up with Trump. And when you look at this, with our former enemies, you may not understand, but basically. Superior enemy? How much time we have? Nuclear war? I would like to like set everything ready before that. Basically we need to fulfill our our uh manpower need before we start before we declare war. Otherwise there is no point of in the war revolution. Yeah, um, actually like at the time of independence wars of both Estonia and Latvia there was agreement for Volga in Estonia and Volga and yes Based on that, Volga region belongs to Estonia. I think the later there were, there were like other other pacts or something like that. Then. What it belongs to Latvia. How long do we have still though? To annex, or actually start the war to annex? Let's let this division to repair. And also, army defense and trail on um, infantry. This gives us bonus. Um, will it join? Uh, the road danger is low enough. So now I'm not like at the moment contaminating, but this gives us basically safety. That if it for some reason should start to fail, just call them in and they help us, and we're saved if needed. Definitely more. I don't need more oil right now. Or we soon. Yeah, we need to. Oh, they have five divisions as well. I would like, of course, to have like stronger, stronger division than plate. There's nothing we could do actually. Oh, we be right back. Alright. Alright. <laughs> Estonia. Um, 
Estonia, Italy, Germany. Three great powers. Makes sense. Now. Alright. Let's declare war. Let's not go our allies just yet. Let's take what's ours. Maybe I should have gotten like one more division. Basically, without the civil war, we would have two more divisions. And it would be just easy. Wait, where is our. Oh. I don't know where plants anymore, but. Yep, alright then. That's bad. Grass. But we should have like better template than the Provin. Or we can just. Do another strategy, interesting. Basically, take Korea without any fighting. There is no way. If you already wanted war, then everything belongs to Estonia. Basically, draw. Wait, what? Two Estonian divisions? You're not fight against one Latvian? Also, there? What's going on? Is something happened? Or what? 4,000 against 2,000? That's really unusual. Alright, so we defeated these guys. They still think that enemy is superior and stronger. For what reasons? Oh. Basically river stuff. River stuff. Alright, now. Let's encircle divisions and send others to up out next to Riga. They basically have two two options to get that part pocketed. What would be great for us? Another one is leaving Riga. What would basically mean free victory? Also good for us. Let's take dog of pills so they would have basically no more resources in this area. Definitely one more military factory won't hurt. I mean I could go right now for um, Riga, but no, I, I just want to destroy all of their military before. That gives us some army XP, of course. But there are also other reasons. Alright, now when you left it, now there is no option other than me. What? I still need to take the Empire? Alright. We are not rushing to I am the one who rushing to Well, that's him. Welcome to Estonia. There would be nice... It would be nice if there was like option to... Core it. Jo siis hädas minu randa, 
Even Walker does not count as a core province or something? What? Or at least it's a hmm. Spaivalet. Yeah. That's great. Let's see, we probably need like some better templates, like strong, stronger ones. Any broken factories? What? So we got no factories from occupying that? Seems a bit interesting. What? Resist resistance grows? Alright, we need to do that. Who summoned did that? Maybe that one. Like, I would not want that to use, but we need to control our land. And right now you may think, well, why I basically annexed that way. And yeah, reason is basically simple, that's our only hope. The bigger and stronger we are, the bigger chance we have to protect our border. Let's also get some naval stuff. Right now, you guys use that kind of things. How many? How much manpower I need? Not anymore. Right? Uh, like five thousand more. Basically, yeah, we need the um, resistance to get smaller. Then we will go to like I don't know, gentle or something. Then there will be no problems. I don't want to suppress them, but I also cannot allow them to get any kind of freedom. Like now, they are part of Estonia. They didn't give us what belongs to us. That's their fate now. Let's, as soon as possible, put this one plane into air. I know what you're thinking. It's one plane. You're not here anymore. What will it change? Realistically, nothing. But I still want to do it. So that we technically have an air force. Active air force. It will be weak, but we have it. No. We definitely need construction factories. We basic civilian factories to construct um, some defenses. Let's 
let's actually try to... Let's hope that this gives us some... Does it give like... Extra map power at some point? Seems like it don't. But I still think that we need that one. Like this is mobile. Warfare. But we have nothing to do with this really. Sure, I should. All right, let's take that one. Let's add some more artillery supports to our small divisions, other part of our small army. Let's take the risk and try to also take Lithuania. We basically need to either give this memory region to Germany or leave it as a country, free country. Because I don't want to go to war with Germany over a memo. That's, that's really one of the last things I would like to <laughs> Let's get Kalev class, class submarines. Let's switch out our artillery production. We have some navy experience, that's nice. How much time do we have until war? 300 plus days. Let's give our army what we need more men in division. We need to stop and actually train to get some army speed. How much more do we need? 10 points. So for 6 extra needed. Now, um, military, what, oh, this gives us plus 5 points, so we don't have to train anymore, that would be great. First let's add this one infantry, and nextly let's add this one artillery. Definitely not the best division. Seems we actually need oh, 20 years of Estonia. Yeah, cheers! Army defense, that's what we need. Definitely need. Thank <laughs> you. 
Uh, this part will be great for us because at least at the moment it does not have any border with Soviet Union soon it will probably have border but if, if Germany should lose Greek then they probably are able to take at least that part by themselves Baltic states will not will have basically more land south border with Sochi. We hope it makes it make sense. I think that I'm right if I say that it's one of the speeches of uh, one of the speeches of Constantine uh, Bats. Um, and at the same time, there's some, some right the speech and everything. When I saw Estonia flag, I already thought, well, GG is probably another civil war. Don't know against who though. 69% of Moxit and 0 for others. Alright. Works for me. This is an basically everywhere. Fort is basically the only thing that our attacks is what? Do we need to change that? I'm just looking. 1.5 with it. Alright, so it actually gives minus. Anti-commit turn, I mean, I guess we really just have to join it. Like, of course, there is a theoretical chance to just say no, but in reality, no chance. At least six. Hmm. 
täis tüürm on taevani purjus. Neil mõlemal brauningud on. Ja meri on jõhker ja pootsman on lurjus ja kokk on üks kuivama kon. Right, to cover all the part of the of they have allies now, right? And it would also be war with Romania. I mean... Is it worth it? This would also mean war with Poland and therefore probably Romania. <laughs> I don't think it's worth it. It should maybe be ready for it. Even. 88 divisions. Lastimest maha, kolm löödimest raudu Jõuda braunindu vastu ei saa Ja mürisev ümber, täis laineid ja haudu Merehuntide taevas ja maa Need, kes elumest jäi, red jõid ja need lõid Seitse meest paitis salamas pokri Need, kes elumest jäi, red jõid ja need lõid Seitse meest paitis salamas pokri I can see moving at least one of her killers would help We can buy stuff, we can stop buying rubber and now we can just focus on buying iron. Alright. Is there like for the fang thing anywhere? I would need one. There seems to be not. Um, what to do? I mean, all right. We need to. We need that war. With Germany on our side. All right. No more training for you guys. Seems like we have reached our maximum manpower. So we need to do that. It gives horrible penalties, but we need more manpower. That's necessary for our country. See, like what Germany thinks. Vienna words. Hmm. This.
this warp, then we probably have a big problem. Uh, at least they have like faction, so they cannot just join allies. That's one good thing. But yeah, now um, Germany seems like they're ready for war, potentially. Not on western side though, definitely not ready on there. Is this the broken song? Yep. Basically, you two you get new commander, Leonard Quare. Uh, never heard of that guy, so not sure if this is real. Interesting that Germany has me no help. Would they be successful? Risky. Yes, give us, give us help. Yes, yes. I don't know, let's maybe get that. We need to be ready to push in Lithuania. And at the same time, definitely hold in Poland. That's what we need. I don't think we are able to do it, but we need to. If they are not ready before, then we have to be clear on 5th. Simple like that's the time when we have to. Fourth. Right, they're ready. Therefore, wait, let's see. Declare or all that right. You better join, Chairman. Alright, we are basically getting pushed by Polish divisions. Well, I mean, it makes sense. They're both outnumbered and they probably have like better guns more than that. So it makes sense. We are getting pushed back. But yeah, basically, my goal is not to like single handedly. Wait, they have more fielded manpower. Germany. No, please. Please do not get into war with allies right now. Thank you. Otherwise, it may be just a bit GG. Yep, they're definitely not ready for potential. If you know anything about war of Germany, then this is just sinister. Oh, you are 
So we actually got one step further. The problem is that to just set to print That would change all the situation very much. Oh no, you're getting volunteers from outside. What's the situation of building manpower? Now we have one. Great. Can we get it? Can we get it? If we got then we could we could get more circumvent, destroy a couple of their divisions to actually No, you're not going there. You're pushing these guys. You're against them. Of course it would have been like much easier if Poland were not in choice. It would have like Sigurd and the Regionals. Lithuania, of course, if they had got like any help. Then not single hand. Go from that way. Basically, a Gauna Center. Let's try to take Kaunas now. If we can make it actually, then it will be great. Um, right. So, Czech problem actually. This time, went well for us. So we could like basically encircle Kaunas or make them leave it. I don't care which works. Definitely. Oh, nice. So Lithuania just gave up, basically captured. We got one more factory now. French are mixed. Huh. That can get us into some tr into some trouble later. How much do we have? Seventeen percent. I mean, basically, we need Sweden. Don't care about mammal part, but the rest of Lithuania. Is what I want. Of course, some um, land in Poland would not hurt, but that's not necessarily needed. Wait. My German troops here? Strong enough to hold? Hey, hey, hey. Go for a little sneak attack. Do it. You know you have to do it. Just do it. Now, kill these guys. I mean, they, they took Warsaw and I am destroying this pocket. They don't even care about this pocket probably, but I created it and I'm destroying it. So we have lost 11,000. I guess that's the Polish villain I've lost. Basically, yeah. If we could do the same war against the Soviet Union, if we could just put it. Just cut them off, right? Right, they have enough 
Okay, let's, let's just go and then this Danzig. Italy would be nice. Like if Italy joined finally, it would be nice. Oh, Poland. Um, military governor. Fungist. I mean. Let's get that to all states. Alright, Lithuania. You need you are way too much wanting your freedom. We need to be really brutal here. Against you, I'm sorry. Oh no. Am I already in war? No I'm not. Range. Well, um, you better stay in allies. Wait, are you in faction? Yes, you're in allies. All right, then there's no problem. Luxembourg, I'm sure you are democratic, right? You are right. I thought if any of these were fascists, it would be GG. It's in poor relations. Not that I would really like would be ally with them, just not war. Would be great. Alright. Let's fight in Romania. I hope that they will be a ally though. But I guess not, I guess not. How much manpower we need? <gasps> a ton. They're also a ton. How much manpower does this Poland part have? Not much, I, I know, but... Deploy manpower, but... What? I have a manpower? Oh, all right, all right. Um, so, uh, where was it from? How good I do this? There. Felix Poland. Let's see. Way too much artillery. Way too much artillery. What's your basic one? Almost like that. Yeah, all right. Let's copy that. Now, like, let's say did it. Good. Oh, 
We need manpower. Red also. Alright. Basically, let's make it stronger. A lot stronger. Like that. So it's basically close to Estonian one. But with some extra. And now, because we need manpower, it's completely. Delete our own, own army and make that one bigger. Alright, so now we need to produce some support equipment. Should not be a problem, I guess. United States is also communist, so the main fight should not be against democracy, but against Wait, why do, why do we still have two divisions? That should all be. But against the uh, communist party. Let's also give it like This. Oh, I cannot. All right. All right then. Now, could I add one more? No, I guess I cannot. Since it's like so. Oh, it's rising. No civilian. Local police. Still rising. Secret police. What? Even higher? Oh, now? Now? Alright. So, secret police is there. Let's finally get ourselves to the moon. Clearly, let's go for this research shot. I don't worry, Germany. Wait, you want even more wars? A crazy orbit? I will join you so quickly as I can. At least they are not communist. Like, if one of these would just, you know, join um, Comet-Turn, it would be Chichi. Alright, so we get an ally. Now it should be alright. We just join. So far as the Soviet Union. Wait, sooner or later they want us. And I think it's rather sooner. Do they have Stalin? They, not, they do not have Stalin. That gives us hope. Alright, you can join. I'm waiting for these two shots already. But I want them to be ready for war. Alright, nah. Uh, 
let's give them commanders and tell them that wait Romania all right they should be done with them marks by the time I go past we get my minister so let's send them to Romania is that it's not close to me. They have really strong forces there. Still has offered no casualties. That's good. We even somehow do have enough um, supplies. Well, it's also great. Wait, what's that's problem? Do we have like a Polish cheap cancer? I don't understand. Oh. That's great. That's great. India. Oh no. India. Like half of India basically joined. Wait. One call. Alright, basically. Indian People's Republic. Is now in common turn. I hope that we don't somehow go into war with them. Otherwise, it is pretty much GG. Oh, extra research slot. Sure. Let's get some. Construction, maybe. Now, what do I go for next? Let's get aviation efforts. Let's let at least them to fully train. percent of communism never and all the units to our own net I was not ready for that if though I should have been ready do they have any they don't have any divisions on the border. Well, they don't at least have a war call against us. I'm sorry, Germany. I cannot help you. I need to def defend my own country and my own people. Not going too, f too well for Germany. Switzerland. Sure. Please do not get destroyed by Switzerland. Thank you. I'm not going to get any more. No. 
Right. So we allow it to be a bit more efficient. As I can see. But not much. They're going like slowly towards democracy, or not democracy, towards liberation, I, th I think. Therefore, how long it possible to take? Probably way too long. What does this country even have? One civil infantry. Oh, yeah. no, um. oh, that's the speech. So, yeah, this, this uh, part of talk was basically about um, Germans from Estonia being, uh, sh being shipped to Germany. Wow, they have now one of their own divisions. Congrats, man. Congrats. How much more my board do you have though? Enough? Great. It just seems like I may have to get some more of your divisions. Actually, of divisions. From your map or? Because it seems like that they are they are preparing for war. And I'm definitely not want that. All right. Oh, so I need to start training them from zero. These divisions as well to defend ourselves, so that if wait, so basically, Soviet Union is in war with almost everyone. I don't think they would want to get ask for military access. I could. All right. Sure, I I would more like want that so hmm. let's improve relations. Maybe through the south I could attack but before I need to make sure that my homeland is safe. Sorry to my own people who are, who are now much more likely to get killed. Improve relations, please. I really need to do it. Wait, Conf well, please join allies. Not commenter, alright? And everything will be okay. If you do it another way, then it cheats you. Thank you. Wait. Oh, civil war. In uh, France. 
This means that I have to deploy this tree so quickly as possible. Albania, sure, no problem. Of Albania. Or I mean nothing changes, right? Wait. Does this this I thought I saw Dano Tuva? More? No? Well, whatever. Have I done anything in war? <laughs> no, not single thing. Um, seems realistic. Now oh, let's just go down there. Try to go for Paris. Paris. I, I know we don't have enough troops for that, but you know, we can change that. Like, of course, we cannot give them enough troops, but we can add some. Like, right now, nine divisions to hold it. Should be enough since they don't have more either on that part. Yeah, um, I don't know why, but let's just ask. Request land lease. Of course, they will not give us, but we could request. They were all lacking guns. So let's start land this. Let's give them 10,000 guns. Of course they accepted it. Now, alright, I mean I would definitely like to like get them to not part of me but close to that as possible. When will this load of guns go? Equipment. Uh, sure, let's get some anti tank things. I guess they understood wrong. That's not the line. There's the line. And so, try to rush. Basically, exploit any possibility to get land to us and our allies. What am I missing? Fighter. Hmm. I mean, yes, I am missing the production. Why is it not that way to Paris? I'm not exactly sure. Do they like want to cut off Switzerland or something? Do I actually have to like manually deal with these guys? You also go and attack.
Never mind, let's give them another order. From the closest point to Paris. Straight to the Paris. Rush. At the same time, we need to train divisions because I already understand that Soviet Union is once more, yeah, giving more divisions to our border, next to our border, much more divisions. They see, still say we are superior, they are interior, but if we don't get any extra divisions to there, they're not for too long. Plus, they definitely have better air force available. Available. I mean, why wouldn't you like try to help your ally? And instead, why you like sending troops or or and you don't like even want military access to our lands? So you threw some of these troops now. That's great. Military screen. Oh, I mean, yeah, air screen. That's great. All right. So now Romania is not in war. One war against us, but in June, therefore. Luxembourg. Sure. So you're doing round to match now. No. Alright, everyone, straight to Paris. What? There what are you doing? Now they're concentrating more, right? Oh, yep, they are concentrating troops. Um, so I'm a bit scared. Let's send this tree there. Protect our border. Against any possible war with Germany. Oh, not Germany. With Soviet Union. Let's see Paris. Every single Estonian should go straight for Paris. I mean, of course, every single Estonian in France should go straight to Paris. By taking that, we could get some points. Looking at these numbers, of course, our military could be stronger, but it's at least much stronger than it was in reality. We could encircle Paris, but no time for that. Instead, let's just rush it. Can we enter it first? So, now we capture it, right? 3%, 4%. Great. Now, let's just try to cut through to Calais. For two reasons. First, we can, like, encircle that part. And secondly, this would give us opportunity to maybe even capitulate it and get some extra points from like getting Calais and stuff. I want so much land as possible. Belgium, alright. No problem with that. 
A vényeg a And now we are here in Norway. Interesting. Um, what's left there? Thing that I cannot take, and there is no way for me for me to puppet it. All right. Well, so I got nothing out of this war, but in that war, we have much bigger chance to get something. I stop this rush now. And go to like pal balanced order. So we lose less money. Imagine getting a new best on it. That would be a great meme. To like nuke nuke Moscow with Estonia. Let's do nine points. So in circles, another division. Let's just destroy it. Like, why no one even tried it? Let's give it our best. If this happens, then we can destroy these conclusions. And this will actually give us quite a good opportunity. No way you are retreating. Alright. I guess. Basically, if you like, destroy allies and also destroy Soviet Union, then if I'm correct, this should mean that we survive this as two. That's really what I mean. I give it be really nice. Oh, what should I make? Sure, some ability to interrupt. Alright, we took Brussels. And it's capital of what? It showed like it's capital. And I don't think it's capital of Germany. I'm not sure though, but I don't think so. Um. Now. So there are no solutions. Go for their last capital. Because if we take that, then it's basically over. On Euro in Europe, with allies, then there will be just United Kingdom left. Like yes, our contribution for this bitch really isn't too big, but it was decisive, I would say. Basically. Yeah, 
Yes, in circle one, division. Let's see how much we have lost. Three thousand. Was it before? She was Fran French casualties. Forty-two thousand, just French against us. What about the uh, no Belgium? General losses of Belgium. Three point eight. All right. I mean, these numbers numbers could be bigger, but I'm still really happy with them. I mean, it's really optimistic, but let's take my my try. I take my chance. It it could give me like one more percent or something, if we, if we take it actually. Hey. Alright, so they capitulated. Now we can just crush encirclements and Netherlands, and then that should be it with allies on um, mainland Europe. Territories. I guess I can go from that to secret police. Wait, is it actually rising? Yep, it's rising. Well, back to military governor then. Because whatever happens, I cannot let them do anything. I mean, like infantry. So let's get this one. Let's try to kill some of these guys as well. Probably I won't get there in time. Yep, I didn't. Well, now, what could we do? I guess I should send all of my divisions into defense, just in case. Of course, I could go to war with Hungary, but it's risk. Because there is a small chance they would join Omitter. That would be game change in a bad way. So now, um, what happens if we give them just one gun? Awesome, basically, right? Yeah, minus zero paint. Still probably need gun. How much of these guns do we have? Six hundred and twenty one. This equipment 250, 250. What else? Would you possibly need artillery? Old one. 320. 
Alright, now they are concentrating on war with the Soviet Union. Yep, you are preparing for war. But um, I don't think that these divisions on the border are enough. Like, where's your, where's your major might? Fifty-six. I don't see these divisions. Where are they? In Africa, or what? I I I thought I was kidding, but actually, big big amount of them are in Africa. Hmm. And one hand, in one hand, yeah, sure. At the same time, oh no, because you could possibly get wrecked by. Wait. Wait, so it's Union M. No. So we have everyone recruited, we possibly can recruit. These a bit. I'm not sure if it works. Works like yeah. Secret police. Um. Gave us some manpower, not much, but still something. I guess I should not send any more than this. Since yes, we do have enough guns, but we need to reinforce. Um. This tree. Do we have any like naval? Company? Yes, we have one. Wait, I just wrong one. Vitka. You will patrol. Let's see. Um, let's give them opportunities to repair. have a ton of divisions on our border. How much time do we have until war? They're ready to declare it, so not at all. We do not cancel it, but let's build some forts. It's a higher priority. They are getting pushed back badly. 
Oh, alright, it went to green. Like, why? Why you need it? Never mind. I take the risk. Like I thought they're trying. But at least right now they are not successful. Again, alright, let's call them to help. It seems you are sending exactly the amount of troops we need, also known as zero. <laughs> Just for me, let's start some some nuclear research into our bomber. Sure, let's use them. Eight percent. What? One million losses already? Oh. Yeah, it's a um, wrong war. Is this war? We have lost zero men. Huh? You sure? But they have lost 15.8 thousand against us. Um. I mean, so it's me. So it's me. Give us. Yes, uh, that's great. That's great. We'll fight for Estonia. Occupied territories. Can we keep? Yes, I think it's. I mean, like everywhere else, it's not going so well as it is in Estonia. Of course, um, like Germany has, everyone has a ton of troops just here. If they would start an attack, I would. I could try to help it, but I don't definitely. I definitely don't have enough power to just start rushing by myself. Should I? I think at least not yet. Well, I mean. I mean, nobody likes it. But yes, young eagles, also known as in Estonian Nordic Kotkat. If they want to fight, I mean, we need. Well, we. Uh, oh, oh, uh -huh. What I'm talking about. Of course, we need. Manpower. Uh, this does not affect well or thing, stuff, but. Yes, we need it. Our propaganda. Why not? Northern France? Um, why are you not rushing? Why are you not pushing them back to sea or anything? Do I actually need to send troops and deal with it myself. Alright. Oh, 1000 against Soviet Union, 61,000 against me. Alright, but yes, it sounds great, but let's be honest. Without <laughs> help of access, I could not, I cannot, I could not hold it. I could not hold this land. And also, I'm not able to push anywhere. Go ahead and train to well no way too low and power level would be fine. 
a rushing Narva pretty, pretty a long time already. They're rushing pretty badly. Well, are they doing it just so we could not get our bunker level up or what? Because if that's it. Wait, they, did they just destroy the final level of my bunker? Or yeah, Well, that's that's not so bad then. They are getting defeated in other parts of Poland slowly, but they are. At least they're pushing finally back to British. There's another one. Like, yeah. And sorry, my manpower, but it is needed. What divisions are they? Template. Template 12. What template is them? Infantry template 12. We all right, all right. Seems pretty strong. Um, Requis forces. Five. Let's actually do one. To defend yourself from I don't know what. These four. You'll we'll actually just now go and try to push back these invasions. Because that's what, I, what we need to do. Otherwise, it's getting only worse if there will be open up of a second front. Even though it already seems like there is gonna be a second front. Let's give them at least some sort of a commander. Alright, let's actually... Wait a bit. Guys are actually rushing there. Well, but now I have an idea, another idea. Why don't we just put the line there? And this is more. Front and go and rush for this town, this port. I mean, if we are successful, and we have to be, and this would mean a lot for our military.
right? So Germany actually pushed like one province further. Now they're actually like trying to attack. Let's give it a try. Germany, you need to attack as well. Otherwise, it's just a waste of manpower on my side and nothing on your side. Oh, you actually took Ireland? If you like, use it as a base to rush UK from, it would actually be useful. In Estonian Pihkwa. Uh, see what we once held in our War of Independence. Alright, it seems like our forces are not able to push. Unless this. Well, we may be able to push this one to more province still. Little province. Big, but still something. Yes, we did it. Therefore, now we need to also get that promise to our hands. Otherwise, we are just getting encircled soon. That would make it a ton harder for us to get circled. Let's just, you know, make it seem like our intentions are elsewhere. And push that way. Push, you know. Alright, stop pushing, stop, stop. Finally, need to go and destroy it. If that's done, we can start a little push on this front. I just hold the line right now. And at least, since at least to me it seems we are not able to get a breakthrough. We have lost now 8,000. Against 128,000. That's pretty good ratio. If Germany was able to do it, then we would have already won, probably. Because it's better than 1 to 10. And they have lost. Alright, um. So, now. Oh, shit. Same time, Poland. You have any, any other? Just one division. Division. All right. We will leave it to you. Oh, why am I? Why am I on pause? You know, if I just rush it. or anything. Like why don't they have more divisions? They have some manpower. Alright, much of manpower. That probably with the reason.
to know you for. We'll go to this small part of the front line and we'll try to advance soon. If Germany starts with their attack again. Let's see, occupied territories. Alright, everything seems good. I mean, is our naval force really holding it? This is so stupid. But I like it. I, I like it a lot. I could ask control of the states, you would give it to me. What? You will. You would actually keep some land. Alright, I mean, I would probably not want Moldova, but some other land. Maybe actually. That would give me some factories, but probably it would take manpower. So, rather, do you have any manpower? Some. Oh, all right. Actually, let's try to maybe take Pskov instead. Because I think some better. Work. It was like too hot to get it. Wait. Will I go there? Without Russia? No. Wait. I still could get to Moscow maybe? Alright, they're sending help in. Somewhere else should now be a bit more right. right, stop your attack. Things work. No, no point of wasting more money. Could I possibly? No, I think I, it would need. It would mean that I would have to concentrate all of my forces at the north. Then I would probably have just a small chance to be able to conquer Saint uh, Petersburg nowadays. Then it was Leningrad. Just please, please rush me again. I would like to go to some like that. How will you attack me? You won't. Well, that's sad. Because basically, I don't have forces to attack. And they just don't attack. Chicken. I mean, I like it. You're rushing while being outnumbered badly. 
Like that's what Germany would do, but they would actually be, su be successful in that 2%. We have killed 150,000 Russians and we have 2% war participation. I would not say it's too much of a fair thing. Um, they're trying to enable the maid again? I mean, and there is no one to stop them? Um... I'm just like, sorry guys. Wait! It took one of our provinces. No. 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 They won't. We cannot help Germany. Either. It would be nice if you could like garrison your own area, and we would not have to do it for you, Germany. Actually, what's Italy doing? Wow, they are actually doing pretty great in Africa. And at the same time, Yugoslavia. Yugoslavia has Sisalke. Hmm. Weird situation. It's just Russia. Like, the perfect thing for me is when Soviet army rushes. I'm not out of manpower. I would not run out of manpower. And they will not take single, single, little price thing. That's like the perfect thing for me. Like, because that way they lose way more manpower than we do. Alright, so I guess it's time to, you know, shorter. Short term runs. Alright, so we can defend this actually. Then let's give a front line of, of course, from Narva to there. Possible offensive line. I don't really want our illusions to die to attrition. I would rather rather see them defend our homeland. Any problems is taken no. There. No, but they are actually trying to act one. Same for Narva. What? They're actually removing troops from Narva? Hmm. Let's 
Alright, Latvia is soon. Soon in almost zero. Blue numbers. Local police force. If we could at least hold these numbers. Alright, that's good, I guess. Alright, they cannot, but close enough right now. Please build this fort. Thank you guys. Let's try to build another fort. What's there? And also another fort there. Other provinces like seem to be not having so much trouble. If I can hold that, then it should be alright. Well, what's going on? It's not red. Now oh, it's we probably got the room removing some part of their army. Because they are missing the strength, really. If they would not have underestimated, they would probably have before but they didn't where's this one division I don't know why is it here all right um Alright, now we have a problem. We have actually too many forces in there. So for after you go, uh, after you stop building it, let's get some new infrastructure built. I would get that, but it means minus ten percent. Minus three, I mean, minus three percent of of uh, recruitable population. That's not doable for me. Do we even have any resources? We have some iron. What would be the thing I need? But it gives a ton of bonuses. Let's just leave it that way, at least right now. I mean, I think we could attack, but then Germany should start to ru uh, start the rush. Maybe be able to take Leningrad. It's just, this, it's just five provinces that would need to be taken. That should give us plus defense, and that's exactly what we need right now. Then Germany. Germany is having like really bad resource problems. Um, maybe you could try to do something. All right, realistically, you really cannot. It would be nice if um, Italy and Germany combined attack against Sicily would be successful. All 
right, enemy superior again. Let's see. Both Latvia and Poland, the resistance strength has risen, risen. but I mean, it's stable, so it's alright. At least it doesn't go any higher right now. Music. I think it was another glitch one. And it has been like that for a long time, I guess. These names of our ships, they're great, great names. Basically, these uh, sub, uh, Lambit and Kalem were actually ships, like real ships. Before the World War II, they really were such ships. And yeah. <laughs> Let's get just for me a strategic bomber and let's actually go for the next stage thing because I actually like to nuke Leningrad. I know, it sounds like me, it sounds like something I cannot do, probably again. Right, maybe I'm not Leningrad, but some kind of front, some kind of front, that's it. To nuke Soviet Union, it's Estonia. That will actually help us. Well, alright then. I mean, you were able to defeat this one division, right? Africa division? Alright. Enemy superior, right? Yep. Therefore, I cannot attack. Alright. Germany is rushing south. I hope they are being successful. Let's take that one. Not sure if that's right form for us, but let's try. Wait, what? 
says like we had like we need more than 100,000 in training minus 209,000 men what wait what that's a bit interesting how we have in training minus 200,000 men like what what's going on What are you doing? <laughs> Norwegian it. Alright. I mean, like, it will change, I think. Please push them off. Alright. Estonia, I'm just there to defend. I cannot really like take over Soviet Union, I'm not able to do it. Of course I would like to, but that's not realistic. Military police actually I would not use it anyway. Let's instead get a bit quicker research. Let's get rockets. Could, could we actually do something with rockets against them? Seems like Poland is soon out of manpower. I mean, most of our military from them. So, I understand why. I mean this name, Leonard Goer, um, basically means Leonard Dog. I guess, thank you Germany for defending my one goal on the way That should be enough of one ways for us Therefore I'm actually not, scan not cancel Just last one Alright Seems like I actually have to destroy it Seems like I have guns, but I have old ones. What? <laughs> you can... You can... Use... Jan Denison as... Democratic... Democracy? 
from. If original country is not Portugal, but you can only use it externally. No sense. I just wasted some political power when I tried to improve relations with Soviet Union. It'd be fun. I'd like to see, like, how it's. Like, basically, how are they doing? No, well, no, not really. Gonna escort. I know it gives me basically nothing if I have like one submarine for that. Let's just try it. Good. Oh, good. Yep. So it's slowly but going for our way, but it's going our way. Maybe they could like send their troops to the south zone, but scout planes? What does that give us? Air weekend. Why not? But it's Enemy has air superiority win. There, but yes, Oh, so there actually are US students. Basically I need more constructions. No, like civil just construct nukes later. I know it it will all be big mean, but I really do not have anything better to do. Like what could I do? I don't have manpower to rush them. On land. So yeah, nukes are basically my only opportunity. Basically, about our navy, um, I can't see. Soviet 6. Oh, prepare. 
Wait. No. We will not have it. Much want. Right. We'll get what we want. The spirit is sick. So they probably are trying to do something with their name. No, no, hold, hold that part, hold that part. Almost 900 days. Alright. What song is that? Bombing kill, alright. Basically, bomb, bomb fragments. Experimental rockets. Let's, let's, you know, um, try. Getting slower and slower. Oh, I have not actually. What would, what would be the range of that? Mostly for white, sure. Some help will not hurt. Why is Sweden our port on our reporter? Brooklyn's greater Hungary? Let's hope that Lithuania won't do anything too crazy now. There's a log. Almost alright, so they actually active in this area. Alright. So that's our actually main loss of Manpower. If they basically started rushing I would join in and we would have a chance. But no, they don't. It's probably another stock song. song. And another one? What's wrong? What? In that room? Play? That's sad.
Küll ma lõhtul seisan vahiposti, kõrgel taevas põhjade. Tuul see puistab mulle helmeid silmi, kui mul on ees üks kindel siht. Kaitsta siin mu kallis kodu, et rahu suinud aviks Eesti neiu, kelle juures praegugi mu mõtte. Ja kelle sarnas mujal teist ei leidu, küll ma oled saad. Actually, he said of rockets. Let's build that. Because I actually want to nuke them. Te saamatu kui põhjade. Ma tihti mõelnud, on see külmuse pamaine. Kas te sel tuu? After that, we still need Leningrad and Stalingrad, at least. So it will be a long war. At least now, finally, we have more than power. Of course, we have to divide it between two. What? They have zero? Alright. Sure is. They have zero troops. Something. Well, hopefully, hopefully it will work out. Even though I don't think so. What? We have lost quite a few artillery pieces lately. From where we it got these dockyards and stuff. What? Oh my god. America? Please join us. Alright. And take out, like, open one new front. Oh, that's, a, that's actually also a good song. But with all of these songs, there's one problem. For me, 
No problems. For you, probably problems that you don't have sense though. So basically this talks about shooting Politrock. Yes, um, poly um, basically communist. Not just communist, but there's something else but other than that, but I'm not sure. That sure. For well, me, at least for me, it's shooting communist. Alright. Soon I will click this button and try. My luck. Probably I will not be lucky, but what better I can do? Let's try. Please, maybe your force is good attack as well. Let's try and tank this one. Alright. Seems like no luck there. Right, we can we maybe can actually take scope. That would be huge. So we have lost quite a few thousand of these that I think. They have lost just only a pound seed. Defeat what? They are now bombing on everyone. Go to that board, the dining board. Hold it. Take scope. Thank you. Let's take scope. If you can take it, it would be huge. I think. All right. You stop attacking. Attacking. It's over for you. Like there's no way you can take them. This process is over. So many glitches. Or like not glitch but songs that don't actually play. Linda Linda Lep Paling Corda Palun Sing Linda Linda Haukele Lenta sin la gusmo kailike, lenta kirellen pulsa, te da pulpo tervita. All of that power. Go there. Lenta ya relica sen. If you could attack from that way. Alright, we, we did not manage to encircle it. Okay, good. Wait, did we actually take? We, we take? We took? Let's go. Alright. My plan is achieved. This they could tell that they could be Swiss. Let's try your luck then. Not anymore, huh? Now you're already. Right. 
so let's just see Poland's South Combo, right? Yeah, pretty much out of my power there. Basically, this province will be great if we can hold it, but scope will be more needed because, first of all, it's, it's like a true town city, whatever. And second of all, it uh, if they if they can capture that, then this part is encircled, and that would be catastrophic for us. Could you please give us, give me like fighters, any fighters? Because I would need some more. A oh, favor. Do they like quickly control like that? Or there's guys. To use a nuke. Airplanes? Do you? You don't, right? Yeah, you don't. What? You have. You have navy. You have five ships. I don't know where, but you have them. It would be nice if they were like. Please, could you like. <sighs> they would be much greater if they patrol these parts of sea. Alright, let's keep. Let's add this to. Basically, let's unite them. That's what I meant to do. The patrol. Overseas. Alright, we're stuck, Song. How many divisions do we have there? Right. Yep. I'm lacking almost everything. Now we basically need to get some guns. Armasta mint kallim, armasta kas kuule, armasta kui lalla lahingut tera. Armasta mint kallim, armasta kas kuule, armasta kui lalla lahingut tera. Armasta kui lalla lahingut tera. Armasta kui lalla lahingut tera. Ja ma tulen sinu juurde tagasi. Armasta kui sinu rinda täida faalu Armastan sinu rinda täida faalu Tänu vat? Eik, jah Tänu tuu vai see pretty much pointless In this war against Soviets It would be nice if we got like These two Like these two bounces 
wrong tone but it will be great. Of course this third one would not hurt but let's be realistic here. This is probably the longest video I have ever uploaded or will ever upload. Well, no, I think I will one day upload on one but it will, there will be probably years to then. Oh my! Oh my god. That is horrible. Let's get myself a surgical prayer because this is just horrible. Now I don't anymore. I'm not surprised anymore that they didn't get that province. Alright, our first trip last. So I think it's first one. Alright, might be second one. Um, so no longer we have escorts. How many ships Soviet Union has sunk? Zero. <laughs> Alright. Poland has suffered way more casualties than we have. Alright. Sounds realistic. Germany has sunk in zero ships, alright. Now I understand why they have not tried to do something against the United Kingdom. Oh, free research. Let's see what they... Alright, what does this give us? Some organization? Sure. Kaitstasin I mean, I could technically cut this video shorter, but no, I'm not going to do it. What? Oh no, 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 no. Night, 
Well, they give us pretty many cards. We have a ton of cards. What? We have actually minus cards? We just need for upgrades? Oh, that's horrible. Let's get the rare superiority efficiency. Alright, we are slowly losing government power somewhere. Like, where is it going? It's actually going for me too fast. Me too fast. Well, they have 3,000 manpower and 100,000 boy in my army. Good for me. They're slowly trying to be I don't think I like it. Let's get that. So we will construct faster. Alright, we have minus seven fighters. Alright, so our navy is in danger again of the year right they tell me they're not but but let's just, let's be honest they really are in risk I like it how the Soviets never actually tried to fight for the air superiority in Baltic states region. I really like it. Otherwise I would have big problems by now. This is one of the places where my manpower goes, as I understand the navy, but it goes there slowly, so it's not the main place. Oh, another stock tank, and another one. Let's listen to some other radio. It's actually, yeah, listen to that.
Wow, we are actually getting manpower from somewhere. Alright, this front is actually stuck. Enemy superior. So there's no real point of me in trying to attack. So yeah, I don't really know what to do. I'm like way too small. Do you do anything big? I don't even have guns to like possibly deploy more. So yeah, I'm not exactly sure what should I do. Offer. Support equipment, sure. Cannot say no to that. Wait, don't worry, battles. No? song about someone making a beer. Really interesting one. Um, I don't like this tax situation right here, but please make it sure come somewhere or something. Kursk would be great to take, but maybe heavily over defended. Oh, that could be possibly good in circumvent. You could like also cut it off from there or something. Then it could be pretty good. What's on the Never heard of that one. So Basically, what? 103 divisions from Venezuela? Doesn't seem too right. Yeah. But well, there are a ton of divisions. Why don't you just try to rush? Oh, that's the reason. Fuck! Actually, what? What? I'm not sure that's what it should be. It's warm. Um. Well, well, well. One division. That's our chance. Chance to get what? Exactly the question. I guess we can make small breakthrough. It's really nothing to achieve. But let's try to actually make something out of it. Alright, yep, it does work. Let's just defend. How much manpower are we lacking? Our divisions are. Why are they? They barely exist! What's wrong with them? What do they need? Alright. 
much is this? The Browns. Oh, they're probably lacking manpower from Poland. That should be there. What do you actually have? Oh, deployed manpower. Not just manpower. Just your manpower is 3. Right? You're trying. You're just trying to make Baltic fleet. I'm not sure it is. It works too well, but you can always try. Oh, it's the town there was bad because of supply. The organization. Can I withdraw, withdraw, withdraw my own division from these parts? To draw. Wait. Wait, there's a connection? That's great. That's just great. Because now. Take all the divisions. Set them there. This also. All the divisions. Set them there. And I will try to make something to start off a little bit. If it works, then we should soon have our open road to Leningrad. Because we. I'm trying to make encirclement. And destroy quite a few of the missions. Hey, make it work. Make it work, I said. Make it work. Press. There. We need to make that breakthrough. Alright. We need that. We need it. So don't don't even try to go away from that battle. Estonians, don't even try to. I know we are lacking every single thing we would need we do need for our divisions, but we need to. We need to. We need to push that place through. I mean, through that place to the sea. Then it's all good. So just send all of your troops there. Alright. It's really bad out there, so. Go on now. Shorten the lines. So basically, Estonian border, and you will be specifically there. Oh, you're already everywhere. Yes, I know, right? That should give us better concentration of troops. Right. Should be Leningrad, or maybe that, yeah. but mainly Leningrad. So, I guess they can manage in south. No, no, no. I need to get 
nicely because they're going straight. Alright, so they concentrate the troops there. So they should there should be a weak point somewhere else. Probably further south. Or did they just deploy everything they got? To defend better. Yes, please, please. Give it to me. Give it to me. Do it, guys, do it. Do it. Just do it. We may be able to do something revolutionary. If you're successful, then we may be able to cut through and at least take take make a run. Well, any At least someone get in there. Get in there, someone. Yes. Two. And now the main army of forty. Wait, two should go there. The main army of forty should go and try to make it to the Leningrad. Like even just encircling and destroying these divisions would be something big. But if we can actually make it to the Leningrad, that would be just crazy. Let's make just that safe move and take these to encirclement and destroy them. If you're not able to take Leningrad, then we should be able to do at least that, right? And you make sure that there will be no retreating from that pocket. Oh, they're sending help from there. But that makes that part actually all right. So we just it seems got one bronze, and because we tried too hard to go for Leningrad, did not get anything else. Well, well, no, 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 not withdrawal, no, no withdrawal. Moments there. There will be no throwing. I, I told you. No throwing. Well, no, 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 no. There are way too many douches now. Stop it. No, you don't. Get a chance to do that. You don't, you don't. Alright, this eight this is a problem. It's not good, but not the worst ever. Oh, is this 3000 already lost? And they have lost 279, so it's not going too well anymore. Because we, now we are the main attacker. No. 
you are not going anywhere. You're not going. Alright, alright. Um, just maybe we should remove our troops from this specific place. Alright, we just so we said to try to rush from there. Alright. Wait, you are not you are not retreating to the troops. You are not I said no. All the missions. That may be a bit much for me. No, you're not. Uh, you're not with troops. With these troops. You know. This big mistake and remains. Keep just one vision, sir. Alright, time is already starting to get really slow. But, no wonder. Send off, send off, you send off 43, so. Makes sense. Could it be chance for Vladivostok? Great. So Japan joined the war. As I can see. Not too successful, but joined. Let's pull out of all of troops out from this little pocket. So they would go to like a bit bigger places. There's more supplies. Wait, what? They're trying to actually send a navy? Alright then. Please win it, please win it. Um, I don't, don't know what, what to do right now. Should I take my chance? 
let's give them a chance to repair. And then I will try and to still cut it off, but I cannot. I will need to look up for that. And I don't think there is too big of a chance of me get it. Oh no. China joins. You better not be big already. Great. No, don't. Alright, I don't like that in Chinese communist. What? These guys are actually pushing Japan? Or actually, actually Manchukuo, but still. Um, I don't like it. So the tune is actually big and strong and they're not even trying anymore. Well, technically they are, but not really. Just try right to the one round split back. Well, not back, but to our current. Doesn't seem to work. Oh, that's why. Well, I have a plan. I sent all of our available forces there. timeline. Germany was not so big anymore by that time. Please say that they have many divisions. They have a few but not so many that would that they would like change change the situation on front. On front or something. Like yes it's good cool, if we get rid of that but nothing came changing. Your best try. Your task is to basically keep them from shining. The battle in the north. I should maybe it would be easier if I like. I don't know. Maybe if I. Wait, wait, what? Go in there. Take, take care, chance, take care, chance. Don't take care, chance. Even though it will likely not work or anything, but I will. Alright. I take my chance. Well, it would also help. If you got rid of just that, well, that for a second new place, um, just to have a chance, we need to build one switch combat, that's all we need. Actually, for just for a moment, 
I like really need just one bumper to be completed. change course of war. Probably the only way we can do it, make change the course of war. I mean from their attack would be great but I don't have any illusions there. And it would be pretty much unrealistic for me to see the camera there as well. Like I mean unrealistic that 
vehicles are in control. So I'm just gonna try it. Possibility that we actually can start then start big like attack. It's a small chance, but I'm willing to risk. So the first moment we get here, we will start moving forward. They cleaning grids are actually cut it off and then take it. Please, just move in before we move out. Please, someone. Go further, go further. That will definitely make a difference in the war. We actually took Leningrad. Well, that's great, but we have a really small land, a really narrow. Now, your order. Maybe that. Just take whatever you can, basically. If just possible, then give it a chance. If you win this war, then it's finally over, basically. Of course, then there will, there will, there will be technical chance of, like, I don't know, what happened. Of Britain just coming back, back from being killed. Wait. Do we actually have a problem? I hope not. Where are you six? Just let's see. Oh, we encircled some one actually. But then let's try to get more birds. And just let's give it a more to do it more or more aggressively. All adults sir. Now it's time for that. I know it basically makes everything as problematic, like also, but we just have to do it. Three percent? I have killed over three hundred thousand enemies. I took Leningrad. You say it's three percent? Sure. Basically, what we need to do is rush down, try to complete encirclement. Because if we manage to do that, then we should get a ton of new Russian skills. Oh, 
everyone to those houses. Those houses. Because if we complete that... Oh, fall of Moscow? Great. Really great. Please, please make make connection. If that happens, then it's GG for these divisions there. And we can basically pay back these guys for trying to invade our land. That would be perfect. Or almost perfect. Like perfect would be if there was no border. If on the world there is only Estonia. But they have that would take a long time. Because it would be a really hard challenge for me to get more powerful than than Germany. I guess if we if we are done with the uh, Soviet Union, I guess I should probably push this down too if they are not done by the time. Wait, is your connection or no? I'm not sure. But if we take that, then there definitely is a connection. And therefore, then. It is GG for Soviet Union's that part of army. I think that's the biggest encirclement in this game so far by anyone. And let's be honest, I'm the reason for that is happening, this encirclement. So therefore, go on, come and kill. Just come and kill everyone. Kill these guys. Someone maybe should take that because it's without any defense oh that's horrible bro it's state or whatever it's horrible nothing everyone just please finally make this final push and take it it would be really nice of you. Alright, now. Yes. They lost in loops again. Well, now. I think. Some of you, at least. Circling that peninsula and then just taking it. Should be the goal. Like short term goal 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 from us for us. Yes. It also should be doable. Or it at least seems to be doable. And not even like too unrealistically. How much manpower do I actually need? Alright, it shows just not realistic numbers. I have no idea. Only thing I can really do 
you is just hope. Oh, Gary's an action eats a ton of more man power guns. Well, that definitely hurts us now. They have serum and power available. Basically, maybe I should actually go down there, making circumstances. I'll try to go through there. Somewhere. But through some of some of these want you. Tears and process. Because going from there. If it take years, naturally. Alright. Maybe we should actually do something with my name. Sixteen ships. Like definitely, I'm not able to take over. Wait, are they actually going fascist? Because if they are, then it's just a bit too late. Like a couple of years, like five years, too late for it to change anything. Instead, or something. Alright, let's get give the division order to go to Murmansk. So that if there actually is some kind of you need some something some resistance of their own peninsula, they'll just start to death. You see me like doing random, random things. I research random things. It's because I don't have any idea what to do with research results.
we have a 3% only. I mean it's more than Japan so... I'd say more than Italy. <laughs> I don't know. What is Italy doing again? Like... Usually like... They do something but... In that game they actually... Play really... Really well against like in Africa and against France. All right, not not well against France, but all right against France. Not true that they're just doing basically nothing. Let's destroy this encirclement. Alright, this going just so slowly already. That war isn't uh, even ready yet. Basically my goal is to get to Volokta. This question should stay in Stalingrad and we could get the end. Any illusions? Go and kill so many of the Soviets as you can. They are actually trying to basically get out, but they are not able to try it. Japan is bringing a ton of visions. Um, 
Come, please, please just get it. What? Oh, I thought the enemy actually showed up. Finally, I started to wait, but no. All of you, go down there. You also, all of, all of you. Maybe not all. Right now it will be pretty random. Like who I choose and who I don't choose. New 24. Go down there. Try to take stalling cards. That's all you have to do. enough to make sure it may not actually be enough to make them capitulate. We may be actually need to go back all the way back there where the value was stuck again. Let's say it's under control of Japanese seems oh my god Seems like Japan is getting wrecked at very badly. They actually are getting helped by Germany. And at the same time, you bring a ton of locations here, but what's the lodging there? I'm not very much I'm not too much getting it. Let's make a breakthrough. There's just some breakthroughs and just go through there. Get in there, get in there. be it for starting right? at least you know, for the game what is why is it still not going like I'm still not. How oh, am I still not occupied? Still about 40 days to nuke this really. And now I'm just quite already uh, researching pretty random stuff. I don't really know what to do anymore. Research the tank, sure. Even though there is not a simple percent of chance that I will ever make the fusion. Alright, whatever it is. In that game, I will make the fusion, there is no chance. Maybe I actually have to like cut slider a lot. It's pretty bad when one of your main defense forces or actually main reasons why you're still independent is a huge country or two Indian divisions. 
Not sure if they were like my dog. Sherman heavy tanks. Sure. Four percent. I mean, you say so that the king saw the threats. Well, not saw the threats, but a huge breakthrough after. It's four percent. Also, in fact, you were three hundred thousand casualties. It's the only major threat. Yeah. And we may be, be actually, we'll be actually able to do it. Hundred and four hundred. Already pretty, pretty close. So. Is there an air force? It's actually getting. They like barely make any offense, but if there is something we can use, then sure, let's use it. Alright, I think my research is not really much. Uh, I mean, I don't think they are too fresh. Let's so Well, I still need to do it, so... You better go and get this like single one to Stalingrad. Can we make it? Our divisions are really much tired. Wait, please. Give it to us, give it to us. No. Alright, so let's keep pushing, keep pushing. Everyone mm, it's always attacking me. They're, they're attacking me so I could not attack it. So I'm saying, please go and take Stalingrad finally. Maybe we could. Is that it? Or do we have to like, take Baku as well? Because then we just might do it. Yes. Do we at least get extra percent? Still 4% more distribution. Yep, it actually is down is 4% of world contribution. What's their capital now? What do we have to take now? Is it Vladivostok? Is it, it is Vladivostok. Do we actually have to go there to capitulate them? Seems even that may not be not enough. Let's try to get like the Caucasus. Let's try to basic cut it off. Now this two this four actually.
and take that offensive one. We may be actually able to drop a nuke if it like so slowly goes on. As you can see, if there are any Estonians watching this, now we have we have um, not only nuclear station, but we are actually developing nuclear bombs in 1944. So Estonia should get its nuclear energy now. Like better now than later. So it's uh, it's not like is it time. It's final option, basically. The quicker we get it, the better. Um, we're, we haven't got quite a high chance of getting encircled. Stalingrad has no death. Something is really wrong with this game. So now it's that state of the game. Where we are basically making more breakthrough than anyone could cover. Because there are just a ton of troops just standing there in the north, not doing anything. Alright, so we got Landlis. You know, just go take it so it would be clearly cut off. Now, let's put in focus every single troop, every single, single soldier. Focus it all on there. So, yeah, let's take these caucuses. Otherwise, we actually may have to drop But I will not like to just keep waiting so long. Um, they're not able to beat them off. What? away. Well, you get special. Special order. Where are the fallback lines? I don't remember. Everyone else, yes, um, pushing south will be what you need to do. 
but also go and reconnect, please. The chest accidentally basically kill my entire army. Because if I did, congratulations. I still see how we could potentially lose it. Though. Wait. No, oh, don't go attack them. Just wait. So the four will go away. At least this three will go away. And then we can rush again with N61. We also need repair. It seems like I made pretty good trip for myself. Please make this connection. Make this connection. Is it make it? It's basically defended. Focus are really there, basically less strong. Really strong place. So they really have a good defense in. Basically just make it a bit wider so they don't circle so easily. Of course they will still have a chance, but don't they? Soviet Union is not even close to capitulating. That's what I'm a bit worried about. I think there are almost no Soviet troops there. Just take these small towns. Why are they even holding that up here? Just go. It seems that this final save, or about save. I mean, I still lost it. Like, they actually fought in many battles and achieved a lot. If we. in World War. If you also count that how few of them there were, but um, in not Estonian army, and that, that's why well, you know nothing about them. But in that scenario, what I'm playing. Estonia is actually pretty strong. Estonia strong. Just encircle them, and you just already start rushing them. But they're just actually going to Baku without any resistance. Alright then. Problem that the top down there, there, as a 
possibly, maybe. Now I am also taking Baku. And you think that I have contributed 4%? Sounds about fair. Alright, I already told you that it's it froze for the last time. So, please just let's take these towns and hope that it will be enough to capitulate these guys. Because uh, otherwise, I actually have to fight horribly long in Siberia. Germany, why are, why are you trying to fight India? <sighs> Never mind, that's just a bit stupid. Instead of like, you know, destroying enemies. Whatever. At this point, I'm basically king up on Germany. Like, they are strong, but they do whatever they want, and it's usually pretty stupid. Or at least I see no point in them. Let's go for that point. A few victory points, so let's go for it. Only 21% completed. So I need to go quicker though. Finally at least 5%. Even though I still am not sure if that's honest but... It's something. Now all of this. Now all. All of you. Let's go and crush the final part of the Caucasus. You were maybe... well... You were again going communist? How many you say switches this game has... stirred? Like, firstly to communist? to fascist and now back to communist. At least hurt. Are you alright, you say? Wait. And that is going less popular again. What? So it's going it's already on its fourth switch. Why is it? Alright. Whatever. Let's just go for that. Well, no, wait. Actually, let's go for that. In this north, northern part, is there anything we could go for? Anything we could capture? I don't think there is anything we could really go for. Maybe it's argument of this fire. Could be the thing. 
No, we're not. We're not retreating. All right. game is just pretty crazy. Now you two will be assigned here as well. So all of you will be there. Let's give you order. There basically. And you need to try. thought they gave them the long warning and that they would basically do nothing how many deaths they have made 53 54 thousand I mean almost 650 something thousand I mean yes it's a lot but it doesn't probably want encirclements and stuff kind of I guess just some days before we were able to capture before we were able to capture the last need provinces I think Soviet Union either China or India one of them at least we'll start counting as major I'm pretty sure it is that way Guy down there. Does it make sense that I'm this guy? No. Should I be it? No. Am I? Yes. I like how my war support is 100%, usually it isn't.
almost destroy my own illusion. Well, I may just have made it still. Somehow I have not lost a single foolish. Just a few points to go, and then I can like, and then find a opportunity to. To research. Like, it is really mad. Retreat, 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 retreat. So yes, uh, I have the vision technically, but they have basic strength of zero. Alright, so we have basically two few editions. You are so close, please. the Soviet Union. Just go, just go. Finally at least seven percent. This 
I get the dumb so which will take you longer. It's looking so long. Is it finally over? Yes. Great news, really great news for us. Um, so we can only pop it. Which is just, just where? I mean, it would make sense to pop it. Basically, no manpower issues for me. Sadly, I could not get the bronze I wanted. But. Let's just, you know, get some of that cheap land. To our puppet. So it would be territorially huge. from myself not from my puppet. It's cheaper for me to take? Not logical, I think, but alright. I have no problem with taking land. Can I take boxer decorates here? Yeah. Actually. Resources. All right. Resources just got taken, uh, or at least most of them. Could I pop it up, sink yank? I could. And then. some land but not a master to the puppet oh no oh. accidental took myself this land again I guess puppeting would be what I should do for some even more my power. Pop it, Mongolia. 
Was there still to left to take? Oh, that. No, let's see the borders. They're probably horrible. Yeah, uh, but the war's over. We did it. Estonia is alive. Very much alive. A huge country with population of bit over two a million. But I mean, if you already have played so far, why don't we just keep playing? To nuke UK. Well, never mind. That's the end of today's video, so let's don't survive in this scenario. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.